Greetings. Come on, let me do a thumbnail real quick. <laughs> so I'm growing my hair out right now, currently. And not all the way out, but like, I wanna grow a bob. I was getting relaxers regularly because I had a really short pixie cut. Not really short, but I had a pixie cut, so I liked it relaxed and laid. And so I wanna grow it out. But the in-between phase, come on, come on, cause y'all know. In-between phase is right here. So I got this. I've never been a wig girl. I've never been, you know, somebody who know how to bust it down. Bust down the wig, that was never me. So I got this glueless wig um, from a company, Fair VB. I will link the wig, the specific wig I got down below in case you're interested. We're gonna try this out. I also bought some tools. I watched a lot of YouTube videos prior to getting this wig because I want to make sure I do it right and I don't want my lace flying to the left. I don't want me looking crazy. So I wanted to make sure I had all my things. The girls had these. They had these and they had some adhesive spray. And I also got me a hot comb. All this stuff is going to be linked down below though just in case you want to um, experiment with me. So this is how it looks when you open it up. Um, thank you for your purchase. Cute, cute. What to say? What to say? This is cute. Packaging. Come on, packaging. Come on, packaging. Okay, I gotta get you a little bag. I'm assuming the wig is in here. Also, give you another bag. Let's see what's in here. Okay, for your edges, some clips. To just they they did the little clip thing um, in the video. So when they cut that lace off, <laughs> the clip. This is the True Scalp Tape. This is one of the biggest reasons why I got this wig was because I saw that it comes with all of these True Scalp Tape. Oh Jesus, okay, hold on, this is the instructions. Basically, it's like to make the lace literally look like your scalp. And so they gave you so many because if you want it part to the straight, you want it part to the left, to the right, wherever you put your part, and I'll show y'all when, whenever I, whenever I decide to do this, I'll show y'all. I intended, I wanted to get the 12 inch. 12 inch was sold out. Wanted to get the 14 inch. For some reason, sis bought 16. I don't even know how I got here, but we're here <laughs> with 16 inches. It smells good too. It doesn't smell like a, a factory or anything, you know? Okay, okay, she's soft. If I'm honest, I don't really know what I'm looking for, but it just, it, I mean, it feels nice. The lace really does like, look like, this is nice. This is, this is really soft. Okay, I can tell that already too, that there's like some slight layers in it. Oh, if y'all want to see the inside, cause I know some of y'all are professionals. This is, um, and I'm clearly not. This is inside of the wig. And so you got the clip in the back here. You got this adhesive on the, it's adjustable, you know, adjustable situation here. I'm gonna put the little, I'm gonna put the, I'm gonna put the tape on there. I'm gonna put the, cause I wanna test this out too. They cut this and made it more round. I think the instructions say to do that too. Here we go, here we go. Circular arc. This is, that's, that's, that's what we got. ASMR. <laughs> oh, it's getting, oh wait. <laughs> It's getting stuck. It's sticky. I got to do this off camera. Give me, give me two seconds, two seconds. That's how it looks. Time to put it on. Don't judge me. I don't, I also don't have a wig cap currently. So I'm just going to brush this back. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, this is too professional for me. Okay, okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, hold on. It's a glueless. Okay, hold on, look, she's. Oh, that looks nice. I mean, it needs some more body. Like I would add some more volume to it. She's back. You need to learn how to put some lashes on so you can put my lashes on. Yeah. <sighs> Mom, goodbye. I need to <laughs> you know, uh -uh, don't tell me goodbye. I might cut some layers into it because it, it's actually not that many layers. I think once I cut some layers into it and once I lay, the lace down and like, you know, lay it flat and like style it and stuff. I think it'll be, I think it'll be good. Stay tuned for part two. All right, y'all. So this is part two of me styling this wig. Um, I first started off by using my little clips that I was so excited to use. Um, the hardest part, honestly, y'all, was trying to get this ear flap piece measured to my head correctly. In the video that I watched, a girl was saying how she tried to line up the wig 
with her actual sideburns to kind of like, so just so that those flaps are not flapping around and that they securely like lay flat in front of my ear. The hardest part, honestly, of this entire process. But your girl was figuring it out. So what I did was I parted um, some of the hair out because I was gonna cut some of that hair off, that excess hair. I parted it out until it like laid exactly where my sideburn was and yeah, just cut the rest of that off. I don't know why, but I was so nervous to cut the lace. I felt like, like the moment that I started cutting it, I knew like there's no going back. <laughs> There's no getting more lace back. There's no more like you cut it. It's gone sis, but I was excited I was like once I started seeing the vision and it coming through your girl was celebrating So I took some of this adhesive spray which Worked really well. Um, I sprayed it on to right where the the lace was going to lay and then I just took my rat tail comb piece thing laid it flat and use my blow dryer to dry it in place. There was also some parts that didn't lay the first time, so I just add some more spray to it and went back over it with my blow dryer to get that part laid down. So now I'm gonna go ahead and flatten the lace down to my head. I added a little foam to kind of get the frizzies down. That in combination with this hot comb, 10 out of 10 recommend. I definitely saw a difference in how it laid the wig down on my head. But yeah, so this is the final look before my camera dies. Um, cut her at least three or four inches, so. I love it. So I heard through the grapevine that I don't do a good job at letting you guys know to subscribe and giving you guys a call to action after the video. So this is me being intentional about letting you know where to go when you're done watching this video. To subscribe to my channel because look, this point, if you're watching this video and this is not your first video, you're playing games and I don't like that. <laughs> Subscribe and I'll see you guys for part two. <laughs> I look crazy.